Welcome to this episode of the Palmetto Guardian. This is our first mobile in the field podcast that we've had. We're actually attached to my truck out here at uh, McCready Training Center. As always, I'm Specialist Erskine. I'm Sergeant Chelsea Baker. And today we have a special guest with us, um, Major Richardson, who is actually a Marine who is out here competing alongside the Army folks. Uh, sir, if you don't mind, just tell us a little bit about yourself, the unit, and who you, who you represent out here. Sure. Uh, first, it should be known that uh, this is in the field, and uh, they have me standing in a mud puddle <laughs> right now. But uh, you can't spell Marine without in the mud, so uh, I appreciate it. Yes, sir. Um, so he, he actually came out to compete for the uh, German Arm Proficiency Badge, Armed Forces Proficiency Badge. I'll get it right. Um, along with the with the, the the Army folks out here while they're doing the Best Warrior competition. What's been your experience so far with this event? Well, uh, I tell you what, it's been a great experience. Uh, Sergeant Major Vickery uh, reached out to me and, and uh, offered this up to us and some of our guys. And uh, as you know, it's integrated into the Best Warrior competition. So. Uh, two things uh, really need to be able to participate in the GAFI and, and try to earn that badge. And then the second thing is very impressive, uh, just being able to see the best warrior competition and see what uh, all goes into that. And I tell you what, uh, that is physically tough. So I certainly uh, appreciate what they're doing out here. Now, um, I could be wrong, but uh, I I think you're the first Marine that's ever came out with us during the Best Warrior and actually competed along. Is that that correct? As far as I know, yeah? At least in the last uh, three years. uh, Not sure how long y'all been doing it. There's been some Marines before me, but... uh, Yeah. uh, So with this experience, I mean, are you looking forward to... uh, Do you think you maybe come out again another year from here? Maybe bring more folks with you, or...? Well, uh, I will not be here in another uh, year. The, the Marine Corps is going to send me uh, somewhere else. I don't know where oh, that's going to okay. be. But, uh, yeah, it's cer- certainly something I'm going to advertise to, uh, to uh, take back with, to my Marines and say, hey, this is a great competition, and, and uh, you know, I think you should do it. Um, I'm kind of the leader's recon for this whole thing. So, Well, hopefully you've had a good experience so far with us out here. Um, so far, I mean, we're not all the way through the, the, the GAFBY event yet, but so far, I mean, what, what do you think of it? And, you know, has it been challenging for you? Sure, uh, absolutely. Um, it's uh, the first day events uh, where you do the more uh, stuff you do in tennis shoes, run, uh, flex arm hang, and uh, then the, uh, the sprints. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's a workout and, and running uh, slash walking seven and a half miles and under uh, two hours uh, you know nothing to be trifled at but yeah it's uh, been been uh, it's been a challenge and uh, I always appreciate uh, an opportunity to go work out I actually saw you coming off the starting line out there on the, on the ruck march this morning and you were killing the pace coming out of the hole um, I was very impressed I was like there he goes man I mean he is <laughs> flying um, so that was outstanding um, what do you, you know interesting part of this i don't think people may always realize is um the, the training environment or the training opportunity to get to know your your fellow services that's not something that everybody in their career will get to do and this is an excellent opportunity and field to do it and kind of what are your thoughts on that you know for for army soldiers and marines to be able to to do something together outside of pass each other in the airport potentially well, first, I got to say that uh, you saw me uh, run from the uh, beginning. I got around the corner, and that's when I started walking. So, um, yeah, absolutely. Anytime you get uh, an opportunity to integrate over here uh, stateside, you want to take that opportunity because uh, whatever battle we go to next, uh, chances are uh, somewhere in there you're going to be fighting alongside uh, some Army guys and some Navy guys and uh, all the other branches. So you, you want to get that relationships built here first and uh, lastly I'll say that uh, there is no marine section um, in Arlington there's no army section it's it's all together so um, something I always think about there you go well I appreciate you taking time out of the competition I know y'all still have more ahead of you a couple more days of this to go through some swim and stuff like that coming down the road but we appreciate you taking time out of uh, out of the competition to speak with us it was it's awesome having you out here and awesome seeing you yeah, really appreciate, uh, again, the uh, invitation from Sergeant Major Vickery, and, and uh, wow, what a great competition, and, and uh, definitely going to advertise this to my Marines here in the future. 
All right. Well, we appreciate you for tuning in on this episode. Remember to like, subscribe, and, and join us on YouTube. Uh, I'm Specialist David Erskine. I'm Sergeant Chelsea Baker. And we'll catch you in the next episode.